a disappointing result. A replay on Tuesday. Could it have been worse, particularly the first half? Um, yeah, it's disappointing today. I think from the highs of beating one of the best teams in the league last week and then today, uh, not enough quality in the final third and um, didn't play the conditions or the opposition well enough. Credit to Taunton, I thought they set up really well. Um, but yeah, uh, extremely disappointed with that. They executed their game plan mm. really well, didn't yeah. they? And they had certainly some very good chances in the first half. Yeah, they had openings where, again, we've made the, the wrong decision. Um, and some of the lads are still still learning. Um, and we could have been punished. We had opportunities where we also probably made the wrong decisions in the final third, um, which, yeah, we haven't been doing. We've been we've been very good in the main, uh, especially at home. So, yeah, uh, just had a brief chat with the players to to, to discuss that and uh, tell them my thoughts, and um, we move on to a, a replay, which is what we didn't want. And. There was some improvement in the second mm. half, I think it's fair to say you had the better chances yeah. and Charlie Wakefield went really, really close, didn't he? Yeah, we, we did. I mean, we obviously you're going to have periods of possession uh, in the game, there's no doubt about that, but we just didn't mix the game up well enough. We, 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 we didn't go long when we had to um, and we didn't play when we had to. We got those decisions wrong and that's something the lads have got to learn um, <clears throat> about each other. You know, when I'm making changes and I'm, I'm, I'm putting players on, play to their strengths. And um, that's what we didn't do. But I have to say, credit to Taunton. Um, they, they, they were very good on the day. We weren't, and that's what can happen in the, in the Cup. So we look at the sort of home games where we've done well, and we've got to return to that, because um, I don't want that type of performance again. And you spoke about the conditions. It was really windy, wasn't it? It affected both teams and mm. particularly set pieces. They just didn't look dangerous, did they? Um, no, it, it's sometimes the runs and it's sometimes the delivery. And we, yeah, weren't on the money. Um, I'd say that in the, the final third as a whole. Um, today, we weren't. And we have been. We've been creating a lot of chances against, against good opposition. So... Yeah, certainly a lot to work on. We haven't got much time, I know that, and it's a game that is in the middle of a, of a busy National League schedule. But, um, yeah, it's, it's one to learn from quickly uh, and get to that ground and, and go and put performance in. Uh, I thought the fans stayed with us as long as they could. It's, it's, a, it's always a difficult challenge, isn't it? You know, we're expected to roll a team like that over. Uh, but I've played in plenty of games as a player um, when you're playing against Premier League and Championship opposition. And um, it's not always the case. So, yeah, a little review and then back to work Monday. It did feel like the fans were frustrated that Taunton were pushing you out, weren't they? They were mm. making you go more defensively mm. rather than getting the ball forward. Did you feel that frustration as well? Yeah, but <clears throat> they've got, we've got no divine right, have we? It's, you know, you're playing against a team with a lot of ex-pros in it and a lot of lads that have, have, have played at a decent level. So we knew that it was a tough opposition. And um, especially after they had... A, a, a sort of negative result in their previous game. It always raises an opposition tenfold. They had a good following, um, so all the elements were, were built for that for that um, resilient performance. But we we weren't we weren't good enough. Um, no excuses on that. Nowhere near good enough for the standards we've set. Certainly at home, and um, the players know that. So got to pick a team to go and react and um, win the game Tuesday. And you have that game Tuesday. It's such a quick turnaround in mm. these replays, isn't yeah. it? But you will have Jimmy Torrey back. Yeah, we will. We'll, we'll have a few bodies back. Um, and every player's got to want to play. You know, I'd have loved to have been playing today. And, and, and I, can't, I can't go over the white line and, and, and do that. And I feel like doing that sometimes. We, we have got young players and, and I, I'm, I'm trying to help them. But... Um, Sometimes it's, it's up to them to, to make those right decisions and, and, and at times today we didn't. But they, they will always give everything. The, there's no doubt about that. I think today there was just a little bit of perhaps tension in their play uh, where there hasn't been in previous games. Like I say, last Saturday they were excellent and beat the team that came runner-up in the National League in Solihull. So I know the lads can do it, but... Um, Unfortunately, these sorts of games pop up with these results every so often, and that's yeah, that's um, annoyed me. 
And how do you prepare so quickly to play the, the same opposition and mm. away from home as well? well? It's a bit part of being a pro, isn't it? It's part of being a, a manager and part of those boys being professional. Got to look after themselves this weekend uh, and, and, and be prepared to play again. It's, you know, they play a lot of Saturday, Tuesday games, so they're used to that. But it's um, it's definitely uh, clogged up that uh, already busy schedule. There's no doubt about that. And say so it's um, we did try and make changes to try and get more attackers on. I know there was a couple of injuries that, that I was forced into making. Certainly one change, which doesn't help the situation. But there's enough players to go and um, produce the goods today, and unfortunately couldn't. And just lastly, do you think you'll be able to get any new players in ahead of that game? It'd be tight for Tuesday, I've got to be honest, it'd be tight for Tuesday, um, but the, the, the search is, um, continues to add to, it's not, it's not always to replace, it's to add to, because I know that those lads give me everything. I understand the frustrations completely, but the same set of players beat Solid Hill last week. Um, unfortunately, they fell a little bit short today, um, I've got to make sure it doesn't happen Tuesday.